so today I'm going to be doing a Primark haul. You'll love these videos, so of course we gotta keep doing them. So today is just going to be a sort of holiday Primark haul. They have come out with sort of their summery clothes, or they've just started to come out with their summery clothes, not all of them. And I'm going on holiday in about 20 days and I need to get some just bits and bobs and some cheap stuff that I can just leave when I go to Thailand. Because um, that's like how I like doing it. When I go somewhere like flip flops, I'll take like one nice pair that I can wear at like my Havianas. And then I'll like go get some cheap ones and I'll just leave them there when I'm done. And I just needed to get like bits and bobs really. Some of this stuff is for Thailand, some of it isn't. But the majority of it is a holiday haul, which is why it's called Primark Haul Holiday Edition or whatever I've decided to call it. So, that's why I've just come back from town and I got a huge bag from Primark and I spent about, uh, okay, I spent 47.40 when I was here. Did they charge you for the bags in Primark? No, they didn't. That's good. Yeah, I don't know. I just had a little list of things I needed to get and I got that and I got some more things as well, like... One of the things on my list was a bag for holiday, like a side sling bag, and I found this really cute one in Primark that was just like about that big, and it had tassels, and I like, it didn't have a price on it, and I thought, oh, it'll probably be like, you know, whatever, £10 or whatever. And I brought it to the checkout, and she rang it up, and it was like £20, and I was like, what? So I told her to leave it, because I really liked the bag, which was annoying, but I'm not paying £20 for a bag in Primark. For that sort of money, I can get a nicer bag somewhere else, so... That's a bit of a shame, but I did want to mention that just because I think Primark really is upping their prices. Um, but without further ado, let's get into what I got in Primark. Okay, so the first thing I got, this was like the most expensive thing I bought, I think, and it is a top, and it looks like this. It is super cute. It's going to be hard to show you, but it's one of these long, um, like, cotton-style tops, and it has cut-out shoulders. And it's like a sort of office -y style top with a collar and it goes down to sort of just a, like your thigh length. And I friggin' love this. I might need to go back and change it to a bigger size. It fits me alright but I just want to think I need to want it a little bit more baggy because that's the style it goes to. But um, yeah, super cute. This was £10 and I just really liked it and I picked it up last minute because I was there looking for stuff for holiday and I thought you don't need anything else. But then I seen this and I was like, that is actually kind of cute. Then the next thing I got is just something I needed. It's just a plain black belt because uh, I have like a one that I bought in Pirate before and I've just used the hell out of it. So this is just a regular one. Oh, I got this in large sugar. I wanted to get this in small because it's for my waist. It's not for my, not for my sugar. I might be able to get away with that. Maybe. I'll, I'll try it, but I might have to exchange that. I'm going to take the top back and exchange it anyway, so I might just do that as well, just change the size. Then I just got some basics, so I always wear these, so I just got two more of my black camisole tops, and they were like £1.80, so that's why I picked up two. And then I got one in this, like, mustard colour, and I thought, you know what, I've got, like, one top that, that's this colour. But I thought this would be really nice, especially when I'm on holiday and I have the tan. I really like this mustard colour. So, again, that was just £1.80. Uh, then I took advantage of the cheap shorts in Primark. I already have a pair of these plain black ones, but I just got another pair of the plain black um, with white rimmed shorts. And these were £2.50. And then I got ones with a pattern on it because I've got a few tops at the moment that are like white and I thought this would go really nice with another top I bought from somewhere else and they're just like this sort of man mandala print on there, £2.50 again. And then these are probably my favourite, they're like black and white tribal pattern and again just £2.50 and I get all my shorts in like 18s because I like big really comfy shorts, I don't like tight shorts so I got these. £2.50 is so good because, I mean, even here, like, when I wear those shorts, I just like to walk around. That's I'm going to be living in those in Thailand, so that's why I got them. All right, this thing I didn't actually get on this trip, but I bought it, like, a few, like, weeks ago. And I love it. I'm probably not going to take this with me on holiday, but it is just something for summer. And it is a pineapple skirt. And you guys know I'm obsessed with pineapples. Like, where's my phone? Like, there you go. Pineapples. I love pineapples so much. So when I seen this, I had to get it. I forget how much it was. Oh, I still got the tag on it. Four pounds. So, hello. I mean, the material's kind of see-through. So I definitely wear black um, pants and some black, uh, what are they called? 
tights with this, but I love, love this pattern. I might take it on a whole day with me, I don't know. And then I got these shoes. Now, I, no, I didn't show you guys. Last time I went to Primark, when I bought that um, skirt, I bought these same shoes, but in black. And I, I wore them today. Like, they are so amazing. I wear them out in town because I don't like really wearing heels. But they look really pretty. And so I thought, oh, I'll go back and get another pair of the black ones. But I couldn't find the black ones. So I decided to pick up the khaki ones. I love these so much. These are like the crisscross uh, strap-up shoes. These are like eight pounds. Oh, I got these in a seven. I meant to get a six. I'm not doing very well today, am I? But I really liked the color. Um, and these were eight pounds and I really wish I could have got the black ones again but they didn't have the black I think they're selling really well and they had sort of a wine color as well and I might go back and get those but I feel like I wouldn't wear those as much as I would wear the khaki ones because khaki you can sort of get away with more and it's really in this like like fall and winter with khaki so love those they look very expensive is what I love about these this sells like really in in Topshop and River Island and stuff but Primark do them for eight pounds Alright, and then I picked up this. Now, like, I never, you guys know, I like when it comes to, like, bags and wallets and stuff, I like quality and, like, labelled ones, which is, like, just how I am because I only have one every now and again. Like, you know, my, my wallets, like, Michael Kors and stuff like that. But when we go on holiday, I don't particularly want to be taking my big, like, wallet around. It's, like, that big. So I just picked up this in, um... Primark in the atmosphere section which is just their accessories and it was four pounds and it's just a smaller little wallet um so it just opens up like that oh except they've just tied on there but it just opens up like that and you have space for coins in the back and you've got space for notes here and I just think that this would be a lot better than having to carry around my massive wallet I don't need it um and if I lose this then it's okay like you know what I'm saying you know what I'm saying, like if I lose this it's fine, not that it'd be fine because it'd have money in it, but you know, you know what I mean, so um, I just picked up this, so yeah, four pounds. And then I want, like, I didn't think this would be so hard to find, I thought TK Maxx would have one of these, but they didn't, and um, I wanted, like, if you guys are in the States, you'll see, like, you know the Sonia Kashuk, like, makeup, um, what's it called, makeup bags, they like, are like handled and they're like that and they open up and you can have like two different compartments. I want something like that but I just can't find it anywhere, like it's just, I don't think, it, I swear like I've seen it all the time and then when I actually want it they don't have any. But I tried to look at getting a Sony Akashic one from the States but it's just stupid money for a makeup bag. So um, I wanted a big sort of, like this is a wash bag really but I wanted um, a big one that I can just chuck all my makeup in, my palettes and everything. And while I was in Primark, I picked this up. It was just four pounds, so if I don't use it, I don't use it. But um, it's just this one here, which is really pretty with a sunset and like the palms on it. Um, oh, and I just noticed that it's got a little palm tree for the zip and, it's just, and that's nice. So in here, I'm just gonna, oops, it's a big balloon. In here, I'm just gonna chuck all my palettes and my makeup and it should all fit in here quite nicely. And it's flat, like they had a bunch of them that looked like the train cases, but I'm not going to be putting that in my suitcase. Um, and this is like super duper lightweight, so I thought I would grab that just to chuck everything in. I'm not taking any toiletries with me, we'll just buy them when we're there, so this is just for makeup and palettes. Alright, the last uh, few things are shoes. Oh, and there's a MAC foundation in there, I didn't get that in Primark. <laughs> So I got some flip flops because I like using the flip flops and then just leaving them there because the Primark ones they wear off really quick. So ones like this, um, these were just £2.50 I think, oh no £2. This is like the pattern here, this like really wears off when you wear them like for like within a week. So that's why I just get these and then I wear them to death and I just leave them there. I like this because they had the plaited detail so I just got those and they were just £2. And then these are a bit more fancy so they were £2.50 <laughs> and uh, these are are just some light pink um, plain sandals with this like crystal pattern which is really nice it reminds me of the Haviano ones so I just got these and they had these in white and black but they only had them in a smaller uh, shoe size so I would have liked to have got those but got these instead and then the final thing I just got from Primark is I just got a pair of um, daps because when we go like I said away we might be going like we might do some trekking someday or like we're gonna need to be walking quite a lot where I don't really want to be in flip-flops um so I just got these I like this I know that the um 
the soles wear out really really quick so this is again like ones I'll just leave there um, these are four pounds sorry three pounds from Primark how do you even make shoes for three pounds it's amazing um, and I just got the grey they had black white pink whatever but I decided to go with the grey so guys that was it for my Primark haul for my holiday as you can see it's just bits and bobs that you sort of pick up while you're going to be going away and yeah that's about it really if you have any questions about uh, anything I bought then please let me know down below in the comments if you wanted to see like when I was at Primark and stuff make sure you follow me on my snapchat which is Bella Bambina XX but with three L's not two um, because I'm on there sort of doing vlog style things usually so uh, go ahead and add me on there I add you back and then you can see all my different uh, you can see all my different snaps from the days so thank you guys so much for watching and remember to stay beautiful and I will see you all in my next video Ciao.